everyone, welcome back. Today I'm back with this year's holiday gift guide. I have quite the range of things that I would recommend to give as a gift, or you can actually use this video to send to someone else to let them know what you want and what's on your Christmas wish list. So I hope you enjoy, please subscribe, and let's just jump right in. Okay, so first and foremost is Miranda Fry Jewelry. I'm obsessed with this brand. I think 2018 is when I found their jewelry online. And we're actually teaming up to bring you guys such a good deal for the holiday season. If you spend $100 on Miranda Fry, you can get any pair of earrings of your choice for free. So I'm gonna go over all of my favorite things in just a second, but let me give you all the details for this promo. All you have to do is put $100 worth of items in your cart and add whatever pair of earrings you want for free to your cart as well. Then just put Brianna promo in all caps and it will give you those earrings for free. So it's from now all the way until November 27th. Make sure you take advantage of this deal. So these are my personal favorites. So first and foremost are the Drew Huggies. That's what I have on right now. These are just such a good staple. I feel like they're so glam, but they're so wearable at the same time um they have that beautiful post backing to them that like unique miranda fry design the second pair that i have on my ears right now or in my ears is the maxwell huggies and i love these because well first off i never take these out of my ears they just kind of like sit in there <laughs> and like hug my ears i've never had a piece of miranda fry jewelry tarnish and I've been wearing them again for six years and these I never take out I mean I'm sure I probably should take out my earrings but these are just so comfortable and small that like I just forget about them honestly another pair that I've been wearing constantly that just came out in their fall collection are the Aurora Huggies these are so beautiful and just so like feminine I feel like when I'm wanting to feel a little bit like classier and less trendy I pop on these Aurora Huggies and I just feel so elegant and womanly and girly in these. I just think they're so beautiful. And then this necklace and this charm, I forgot the name, but I will link it down below along with everything else. This came out in their fall collection as well. And I just think it's such a beautiful statement. Look at that. So pretty. This is the MF ring and I wear it all the time. To me, it looks very designery and it's just really good quality, heavy duty, and it's just so luxurious. I feel like it looks way more expensive than it actually is. So make sure to take advantage of this deal. Again, Brianna promo is the code that you want to put in. Add whatever you want to your cart as long as it's $100 and then add the earrings that you want for free. And once you add that code, it will deduct the cost of the earrings. So the next thing that I think would make a really great gift would be your favorite book. It could be any kind of book, but I feel like with the new year coming up, right after the holiday season it just feels like everyone is in like a bettering themselves kind of mood ready to set goals ready to just do all the things and so this is one of my favorites this is by Brianna Weiss and it's The Mountain Is You I love this book I have this on audiobook and the paperback version as well and this is just really great because it helps you really look inward and take accountability and it's all it's just very motivational and really can set you up for success I've read this multiple times already and I plan to read it again. It really helps you address like self-sabotage, what that looks like in your life and how it can show up in many different ways. And I just love it. It is a very quick read too. Let's see how many pages is it? Not even 300 pages. So highly recommend. I love this author. She's got a few different books that I think are really, really great. And kind of piggybacking off of that, another thing would be a journal. This is the five minute journal. And while this is really nice, let me just show you kind of like what it looks like. It's super quick and simple. You write in what you're grateful for, what would make today great, and affirmation highlights and what you learned for the day. While this is great, I actually don't use this that much. I like to just use a regular notebook and do a brain dump. But for someone who's into this kind of thing, like just healthy, you know the type and you know the vibe. Um, I'm one of those basic ass bitches and um, I would love something like this if someone gave me this. But yeah, I personally do like a brain dump and just a regular notebook. Maybe that's something that they would like. I think that even like this as like a duo for someone would be a really, really nice gift. Especially too, like even if someone has like vented to you about like personal struggles, this would be a really great gift for them as well. Now, if they're not into any of that kind of thing as far as like books go, um, I love where the crowd saying I think that's a really great book you could do like a thriller book any kind of book that like maybe you've read or you've heard about if they're not into like physical reading you can also gift an audiobook you just buy it and then it gets sent to their email so highly recommend I think that would make a really great gift I feel like it's very thoughtful too staying on the more like health vibes while we're here I would recommend the hatch alarm clock I wish that I used this more and was consistent. What's great about this is it will wake you up to light or you can even pick um, like rain, you can do birds chirping. This can also have like white noise while you're sleeping um, and they have an app where you can like buy other sounds and things. Um, I 
really love it. So I feel like that health nut in your life would like something like this, but even like the average person I think would like something like this. So I highly recommend, they have like a different version as well um, cause they have updated it since I've bought this years ago. Next up on the list, I have either a sweatshirt or a matching sweat set. I'm obsessed with those Nike sweat sets. And now I've also found the Aritzia sweat set that I'm like even more obsessed with. I love that. I feel like it looks very bougie. It's like very casual, but very bougie at the same time. I feel like a matching sweat set is I don't know, I just, there's something about it. Even though it's sweatpants, it just makes me feel some type of way. But if someone's not into like a full blown sweat set, let me show you like a sweatshirt idea. This is from Abercrombie and their vintage Sunday crew necks are some of my favorites. This one says spicy and it has a little hot pepper here. Um, they've been doing really good with their sweatshirt designs lately and I always get a medium. They're nice and comfy and oversized, but I just feel like you really can't go wrong with a sweatshirt. So I'd highly recommend. So this is kind of random and I almost, didn't even include this in the gift guide because I thought this is like a very niche thing. But the more I thought about it, the more I was thinking, everyone records their life online these days. Everyone's on TikTok, everyone's on Instagram, everyone's recording themselves. And so I recently got this on Amazon and it's a magnetic tripod for your phone. So I haven't even used it yet. So it's kind of funny that I'm recommending it in a gift guide, but I can see myself using it a lot. So this is an intense magnet here on the back. I mainly got this for when I'm at the gym because I would love to record myself at the gym, but at the same time, I, there's no way I'm gonna bring a freaking tripod in the gym. I'm just not, I'm just not gonna do that. But putting this on the equipment and having my phone record could totally be something that I do. So this doesn't have to only be for at the gym. It could be on anything that a magnet magnets to. This works really great at, like on my fridge if I ever want to record myself like doing dishes or whatever. Um, this will fit perfectly like right on my fridge and this just expands and it's really nice. I think this was like 10 to $15 and then this is like a little joystick here, like a little burp. So very unique, very small, very interesting. I think I recommend this in like every single gift guide video, but this year specifically was just like, I didn't use any other hair tool and it's the Dyson air wrap. So whether you're doing the air wrap or the shark, I know the shark is like basically the same thing. I don't have that one. Um, I've had some people ask me to like buy it and compare to be honest. I'm not going to do that because that's so expensive too. And if this is working great and I already own it, like I'm not going to go and buy that just to compare when like other people have done that, like I can tell that it's basically the same thing. So either this or the shark or any kind of hair tool that just like does your hair for you basically. I, first of all, my hair has grown so much in the past year and a half. And the only thing that I've used is the Dyson Air Wrap. And I love this because it takes me just as long, if not quicker actually to do my hair from wet to this than it does if my hair was dry the second day and then I needed to touch it up or whatever, or like curl it or whatever. It takes me honestly probably less time to dry and style my hair all in one go with my air up. So I highly recommend, this would definitely be like a more bougie gift for somebody, but you know, sometimes we have those people on our list that we just wanna buy that one special thing for. So this would be something that I highly, highly, highly recommend. And it's really good for your hair too. It's not as damaging as like a typical hair tool, so. Next up, I have my favorite boots that I got in the Nordstrom anniversary sale this year. Um, these are just so freaking beautiful. They're suede, they have this unique heel here, and they are just so pretty. I feel like these are the perfect fall and winter boot. I did spray them with like a suede protectant spray so um, they wouldn't get damaged. And so far I've already worn them a few times. They're so comfortable and that spray definitely worked. I don't have any damage to my boot yet, but I think that these are such a good classic boot. They do have this in like a regular black leather as well. And I just, Love these. Everybody loves getting a nice pair of boots on Christmas. Another good staple is perfume. So I recently just talked about this in my favorites video, um, but this is like one of my all time favorite perfumes for like the fall and winter time. And this is the Tom Ford fucking fabulous perfume. This is like a deep, rich, like musky fragrance. Another one that I really like is the Jo Malone Peony and Blush Suede. That is more of like a floral fragrance. Um, Chanel Coco Mademoiselle, any kind of fragrance that you know that they would really like. Sephora also has these like perfume sampler boxes where you can get the mini sizes of different fragrances and then you get a voucher that you take to Sephora to get a full bottle of one of those minis which I think is a really great way that they can try out the fragrance 
and pick what they like so that you could still give them a gift to open, but they ultimately get to decide which fragrance that they like. Cause sometimes buying a fragrance for someone is really tricky. So it's a lot easier when you know what they like or the kind of vibe that they like. But I just think that is a good gift in general, just because it's one of those things that it's kind of like, I don't know, at least I feel like it's kind of a nuisance to buy for myself. I love wearing fragrance and feeling fancy and spraying it every day, but when I run out, I'm annoyed <laughs> because I'm like, damn, I gotta go spend like $100 on my perfume, minimum, especially if you're getting like a bougier perfume. So it's definitely nicer to receive it as a gift. So this is not original at all, but I still feel like the classic Christmas gifts make amazing Christmas gifts, and that's why they're classic. They're classic and staples for a reason, and I have here my favorite robe and favorite slippers. And you know what? It just makes such a good gift. And socks, socks make a good gift too. But this is my Brooklinen robe. This has been my favorite robe recently because I just like the print. I like that it's this tan color with these navy blue stripes. I just think it's great for all year round. And I've just been in a very robe place. When I get out of the shower, I'll do like my hair towel and have my hair on top of my head, get in my robe. And that's when I do my skincare and my makeup and I don't get it on my clothes and stuff. And like, this ain't a new idea. This is like one of the, <laughs> the most like old school kind of things to do. But like for so long, I've just like put my clothes on for the day and got ready in those. And I just have turned into a robe person and getting a robe would be a really nice gift, especially a really nice one. Um, so this one's from Brooklinen. I love these so much because they're furry and warm, but I tend to get really hot really fast. So these are open just like regular slides. So then your toes, are still like exposed to air so you're not like dying of heat. It's the greatest combo and these were very inexpensive on Amazon. I do need to wash them. The next thing I have on the list is some kind of skincare, whether it be like say you know what skincare they already use, you can replenish their cleanser, moisturizer, or get like a skincare kit. Um, the other thing you can get like a face mask, whether it be a sheet mask, like a bougie little pack from like La Mer or Tatcha or something like that or just like a regular face mask. I just grabbed one here. This is the Kiehl's Rare Earth Deep Pore Cleansing Mask. This is one of my personal favorites. I need to get a lot better at using face masks to be honest, but this one is really great for just like minimizing your pores and like cleaning them out and getting all of the gunk out of the face. Love this. I'm actually, I might do this tonight actually after this video. Um, but any kind of like pampering thing, you can even make like a little bin or like get like a cute basket and put like the robe, the slippers, the skincare, like give them like a spa experience at home, especially in the winter time. We're all stuck inside. It's nice to like do all the pampery type of things. So definitely would recommend a nice face mask or any kind of like skincare type of thing. Next up, I think everyone's gonna really like this. And it's also very reasonably priced. I feel like these table lamps have really just like popped off on the internet. And this is one of my favorites that I have. This one is from Target. And I think that this was under $20. I hope it's in stock. I will link it down below. And if I can't find this exact one, I will find ones that are similar. But what's great about this is that it's just mini. Look at it in comparison to me. It's not like super giant. It's not gonna take up too much space on your counter but it's great to just kind of like poke in somewhere in your decor, whether it's on your kitchen counter, in your bathroom. It's nice because it just kind of adds to the vibes and gives you that ambiance, that like low light, cozy feel. I've gotten so many compliments for just like the vibe in my home ever since I incorporated my lamps. Um, I have this one and then I have like an olive green one. Even my father-in-law, he came over the other day and he noticed the lamp because I have this next to like my coffee area. He's like, oh my gosh, that's really nice. It's like nice and cozy. And I said, thank you so much. It really does add to the vibes. So I feel like this is very, also very trendy right now. And I think any, any woman in your life would really love this and only 20 bucks. So the last thing that I have on my list here is just like an experience. These are my favorite gifts to give and receive. And it's some kind of experience that you can do together. So whether you take them out for dinner, whether you take them to a concert, maybe you do a spa day together, maybe a staycation in like your nearest city or a movie night and you cook for them and do snacks, anything like that, that would be like my personal favorite gift to give and receive. 
I just think that those gifts are a lot more special. They're more memorable. You'll think about them for years to come. So I'm gonna conclude with what's on my wish list. And I went back and looked at last year's wish list on my holiday gift guide. And actually two of these things were on there last year as well. The first thing is a record player. I would really like a nice record player just to buy some records and play. Ruben and I went to this Airbnb uh, two years ago and it had this really nice like audio setup and this record player. And it was really just such a beautiful sound and I would really love that I still don't know like where exactly I would want to put that I have to figure that out and pick one out and see which one would be the best for us but I think that would be a really nice gift the next thing that I would really love is a walking pad I know you can get them for like a hundred bucks or something but since I work from home I sit on my butt all the time and I need to get better at standing while I edit this year though I developed plantar fasciitis in one of my feet and it's been so painful. Um, some days are better than others. So I usually just sit down, but now I'm noticing like I just sit all day long. And I'm thinking that like walking actually feels better on my feet than just standing still. So um, a walking pad would re really be nice to walk while I edit. And then last but not least would be a new pair of headphones. So I have just like my old school AirPods from Apple, but the right one went out. And now it's funny that I want this because there is something nice about being able to like fully hear my surroundings. Like at the gym, I think I would probably just keep one in. And on my walks, it would be smart to just keep one in so I can like really hear my atmosphere. But at my house, maybe it would be nice to have like more sound. But then at the same time, I don't mind hearing the atmosphere just to be safe. I don't know. Maybe just another option, maybe an option to like go over my ears. But that concludes everything for this year's holiday gift guide. I hope that you got a couple of ideas of gifts to give others. And if you liked anything on this list, send this video to somebody, let them know what you're wanting for Christmas as well. Don't forget about that Miranda Fry promo. Add $100 worth of jewelry to your cart. Also add the favorite pair of earrings that you wanna get for free. Add the code Brianna promo and get those earrings for free. That goes on from now until November 27th. All the details and my favorites will be linked down below. And down below in the comment section, let us know what your favorite gift that you've ever received and given has ever been. I think that would also be a really great way for us to get even more recommendations so that we can see what you've loved that you've gotten and what you've loved that you've given that would really make an impact on someone. So um, that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe. I hope you're having a wonderful start to your holiday season. Thank you for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.